Hey everyone, welcome to another Friday video. I am Anthony for AVP Aquariums and today it's time to look at the Paludarium once again and also add in some of those dwarf white isopods that I got in a few weeks ago. But before I do that, I have to do a little bit of spreading out of my isopod cultures and do a little bit of work on the Paludarium. So I'll be transferring two cultures today. The first is a culture of some common isopods that I picked up outside and have just kind of bred for the fun of it and the practice before I got the white isopods. They originally were living in my paludarium, but I found out that they were eating a lot of the plants in there, so they got taken out during one of the last maintenance sessions. And next we'll be moving over the culture of dwarf white isopods into a little bit larger container. When I first got them in, I put them in a fairly large glass container, but I wanted to switch them into a container that had a little more surface area and land area for them to explore and crawl around and spread out more in. For both of these cultures, I put in a mix of zucchini and crushed leaf litter to serve as a food source for the colonies. All right, so I'm gonna let those cultures sit for a week. In the meantime, it's time to do a little work on the paludarium. The pink vetonia has really grown up these past few months. It does grow a little bit slower for me, but really compact. So luckily I don't have to trim it that often. And I'll also take the opportunity to put in a little bit more soil to help feed the plants. And of course the Dwarf Baby Tears hillside, as I'm now calling it, always needs a little bit of a trimming over by the waterfall. Alright, so at this point, the dwarf white isopods have been in their culture tub for at least a week, and it is time to harvest some for the paludarium. I ended up pulling out about 30 isopods for now. I might go back and pull some more later on, uh, but for now this will be enough to get a good number started and established in the paludarium. Alright everyone, so that is going to be it for today. Hope you enjoyed. As always, remember to comment down below, hit that like button, subscribe for more if you're not already, 
and I will see you in the next video.